Hello, I am Liviu Bolan and, this, and in this tutorial I will show you how to change a user ID or become a super user on Ubuntu. First, I will connect to my virtual machine using SSH Ubuntu VM. Uh, then, as you can see here, I'm having two users. Liviu, which is the default username which uh, were created when I've, I've installed my operating system and Liviu.balan, which is a user that I've manually created. Now, I will switch my uh, current directory to slash tmp and then I will use su Liviu.balan. Then, then I will have to enter the review.balan password. As you can see, <coughs> I've switched my uh, current user, Liviu, to Liviu.balan username. Um, as you can see, the current working directory were preserved, so I'm also on slash tmp directory. If I use print working directory command, you will see that I'm on slash tmp. Uh, if I use the exit command and use the same command again, so leave you that plan, but instead if I put the minus option for the su command, now if I type the password for leave you that balan, I'm switching my leave you that balan uh, to my Liviu.balan uh, user, but instead I'm not preserving the current working directory, but <coughs> I'm using the home directory of Liviu.balan username. So uh, if you are using the minus option, this will, this will provide an environment uh, similar to that the user would expect uh, when uh, he log in directly. Remember that when you use the minus option, <coughs> you must specify uh, the minus option as the last su option. Uh, okay, if I exit this user and use this command here, what this command is doing is to switch to user liveu.balan uh, uh, using the uh, home directory and for this user is running the command ls-li var www.lhtml <coughs> As you can see here, the current user weren't changed but instead the command were uh, run uh, using the, the username liveu.balan. Um, okay, uh, if you use su uh, minus, uh, remember that the default user in this situation is the super user or the root user. Because the root user in this situation doesn't have a password set, uh, in order to connect to the super user, I have to use sudo su minus, because uh, Liviu is the uh, default user which were created with the operating system installation, and this user has sudo rights. So as you can see now, I'm on my root uh, user and I'm able to run a lot of commands without typing any sudo, uh, any sudo command. <coughs> now, if I use the minus C again, I will show you something really interesting. If I exit, to my local operating system and use su minus c nemo, you will see that I'm able to run the nemo 
application with pseudo rights. As you can see here on, on this uh, red label, I'm running uh, Nemo as root. In order to quit the application, press Ctrl C. Now, if I connect again to my machine, to my virtual machine, uh, if I want to run the su command using the full path, I can type slash bin slash su leave you that button. And as you can see here, I've switched my user, but without the su command, but instead I've used the full path to the su uh, to the SU application. Um, <clears throat> what uh, I want to show you next is that even if you log in, logged in uh, successfully or unsuccessfully, uh, your um, action is logged. If I use tail minus f var log auth dot log. And if I open another terminal, connect to the virtual machine, and then switch the user. But before changing the user, I want to show you that after this, the connection using SSH were logged here and if I switch my user using a bad password this is logged as you can see here authentication failure now if I switch my user using the good password this action is also logged in successfully logged in for liveu.palan by liveu Okay, um, <clears throat> another interesting feature is the who am I command. When you use this command, you will see the this will print the effective user ID. So this is the user that I'm using right now on the current session. Um, if you want to learn more about uh, the command that I've shown you, you can use the manual pages for su and also man uh, who am I. Also, you can use this link um, to learn more about switching the users on uh, Linux and uh, on Ubuntu especially. So, uh, I hope I hope you you've enjoyed the, this tutorial. If you want to learn more about Ubuntu and about web technologies, you can visit my website liveubalan.com and also don't forget to check out my tutorials on YouTube. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.